Travel Across America with me. We're crossing the mighty Columbia River into Washington. The Evergreen State. I'm taking you to Stonehenge. This is Sam Hill country. In 1908, Samuel Hill bought 7,000 acres on these slopes. He planned a Quaker farming colony, surveyed a 34 block town site and built a church, hotel, store, offices, garage, and shops. His engineers built 10 miles of experimental roads. As Washington's first rural paved roads, they proved Hill's zeal as a promoter of highways. Three miles to the west, he began construction of an old world chateau, which in 1940 was completed as the Mary Hill Museum of Art. In 1918 to 1929, Hill constructed the Stonehenge Replica, America's first World War I memorial on the original site of his hotel. Fire eventually destroyed the buildings of the never-occupied town site, leaving only Stonehenge, roads and stonework, and the museum as monuments to the vision and energy of this public-spirited American. Have you subscribed yet? If not, please subscribe. The structure before you is the first monument in our nation to military personnel who gave their lives in World War I. It is also a lasting reminder of the works of Samuel Hill, patron of this region. The design duplicates in size and original form England's famous Stonehenge, which is dated 1900 to 1300 BC on Salisbury Plain in Wilshire. When Hill, a Quaker pacifist, visited England during the 1914 through 1918 conflict, he saw Stonehenge and was told it had been used for human sacrifices to pagan gods. He remarked, after all our civilization, the flower of humanity still is being sacrificed to the god of war on battlefields. From that inspiration came this monument built by Hill. On July 4, 1918, the altar stone was dedicated. The full structure was completed and dedicated May 30, 1929. Current belief is that Stonehenge was a device used by astronomers to measure time and mark seasons of the year by observing positions of the sun and moon. The diagram at left suggests how the original may have been used by the ingenious builders. Here are plaques of some of the men who are being recognized at Stonehenge in Mary Hill, Washington. In memory of the soldiers and sailors of Clitticat County who gave their lives in defense of their country. This monument is erected in the hope that others inspired by the example of their valor and their heroism may share in that love of liberty and burn with that fire of patriotism which death alone can quench. Mary Hill Museum manages a 6,000 acre land conservancy that includes much of the landscape visible from where you are standing. Leave a comment below. Tell me about the war memorials that you have visited. And don't forget to subscribe. Tennis shoes on the ground. Unclassic road trip. And I have so much more to show you great places in the state of Washington.